What's going on guys? Dr. Allen here from Maui Athletics. And today I wanted to cover a topic that I get asked quite a bit. Um, people are always looking for how to maximally build muscle while putting on the least amount of body fat possible. Now you will see uh, in a lot of fitness professionals online pushing that you can gain uh, as much muscle as you want without getting any fat. That just doesn't seem to be the case when maximal muscle is involved, but there are ways to plan your nutrition so you can get as much muscle as possible while putting on as little fat as possible. Now there's certainly debate among fitness professionals about the proper body fat range by visual assessment for the optimal um, area that you want to be in for building or bulking. If physique is a goal of yours, then likely sitting anywhere between 10 and 18% is probably the right move for men, while uh, women is probably 7 or 8% body fat higher. Of course, you have to take a person's goals and, um, and personal preferences into play, and certainly working at slightly higher body fat percentages may be advantageous depending on what sport they're going for or exactly what their uh, priority is at the time. So how do we set this up? Alan Aragon and Brad Schoenfeld did a study in 2020 entitled Magnitude and Composition of the Energy Surplus for Maximizing Muscle Hypertrophy, in which they give guidelines for the best way to set up a surplus while gaining the most muscle and putting on the least amount of fat. They recommend that if you're a novice trainee or someone that has detrained and coming back from potential injury or time off, you should increase your calories above maintenance 20 to 40 percent or roughly 500 to 1000 calories above maintenance per day. For more advanced trainees, people that have been training for uh, more than a year or two consistently and intensely, it is probably smarter to raise calories above maintenance by 10 or 20%, and that's roughly 250 to 500 calories above maintenance per day. In addition to this, it would be smart to set protein between about 0.8 and 1.2 grams per pound of body weight per day to maximize anabolic response. After that, all you have to do is distribute the rest of your calories to fats and carbs as you see fit and you're set up to clean bulk as best as you possibly can. Enjoy.